You guys are cool with me being completely incapable of sticking to a schedule. Yeah? Cool. Okay, okay. Welcome to day two. Day... Day two? Day two of this little 12 days of Christmas challenge I've set myself. Before I begin with the explaining of what I've added for this day, I'll first discuss what I did in the in-between, and a couple of things worth a note. Basically, a lot of my old cult was slow, buggy, and a mess. So I did some tidying, I also added some stuff that will help me with other stuff I have planned for the future videos of this series. And finally, I replaced the integer values for positions with doubles as I was having rounding issues. So instead of completely solving that like a normal person would do, why not remove the problem entirely? Another thing to note as well, technically this isn't really a cellular automata. At least, not in the way I understand them, as the cells in my program can contain multiple organisms at once. Realistically, this program has the aesthetic of a cellular automata, but isn't really one, it just looks like it. I did try and convert this code into a proper cellular automata, but I've already started down this path. So now I guess the challenge title changes a bit. Something like the development of a pseudo cellular automata, simulation of life using organisms inspired by the 12 days of Christmas, by Panic at the Disc. Okay, let's go on to what I added. The prompt today was two turtle doves. Initially, I was tempted to add another organism to the system, but then I realized what I had wasn't really an accurate simulator of life, in that there was no birth and there was no death. Luckily for me, turtle doves are a symbol of love. So I got hacking away at some code to make our little partridges get busy loving, and maybe a bit of dying. And it worked a treat. <laughs> well, not really, initially. You can probably see in the background there are a couple of uh, issues. Issues, I think, is the correct word, in that maybe our birds are a little too good at breeding and not good enough at dying. So I play around with the parameters a little bit, and in the end, I think I got, I think I got something. Okay, the birds are still a little too good at not dying, but here's our program so far. As in the last video, let me know what you think of the project so far in the comments. Tell me what you think. Tell me a story, whatever you feel like. YouTube comments, there's no law or order to what goes in them. Please like and subscribe if you enjoy this sort of thing. Check the descriptions for some other cool things as well as a link to my Discord server that I discuss things like this. There's also a really cool community there, mostly of people who like to bully me, but that's fine. <laughs> On screen are this month's Twitch supporters and patrons. Thank you loads for the huge support from you guys. Otherwise. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this weird mini project and I'll see you tomorrow, maybe, for the next part.